Hey guys, have you ever gone to watch your TV and all you see on the screen is no signal? I'm going to use this video to show you the most important steps to get this fixed as soon as possible. It's pretty early and I'm a little tired, but let's, let's do this one. Let's get it done. All right, let's go. Here we have the TV where it says no signal. What you want to do is go to the back and find the HDMI cable that runs from the TV to the cable box. Once you've found it, unplug the HDMI cable from both the back of the TV or side of the TV, wherever it is, and unplug the HDMI cable from the cable box. So let's go ahead and do that. So here's the TV, plug it back, then trace the cord to the cable box, and do the same. Unplug it and plug it back in. One thing to note is that this box has two ports, HDMI in and HDMI out to TV. Make sure it's going to HDMI out to TV because that's routing the signal from the box to the TV. If that doesn't immediately fix your issue, try unplugging the power cable for about 30 seconds and plug it back. Then allow it some time to boot up and check to see if the TV now has a signal. Let's take a look. So we see here that the TV is now working, which is perfect. But if your TV still says no signal, that's okay. Let's do a few more things. So on my other TV, it says no signal as well. Let's try to figure out why that's happening. So we see here the TV has two HDMI ports, HDMI 1 and HDMI 2. The cable is clearly plugged into HDMI 1, but when we look on the TV it clearly shows it's on HDMI 2. So that's why I can't find the signal. Here's the solution. Look on your remote for a button that says TV input or it may say source. Click on that button once to bring up the menu and yet again while the menu is up to change the input to the correct one. We change it to HDMI 1 and oh my gulai we have picture. So we walked through the basic troubleshooting on how to fix no signal on the TV. Let's do a quick recap of all the steps. One is to unplug the HDMI cable from the TV in the box and plug it back. Try unplugging the power cable for about 30 seconds and plugging it back. And lastly check to make sure that the TV is on the right input. So if the cable is plugged into HDMI 2 but your TV is on HDMI 1, it's not going to find that signal so use your remote to change it. By this point your TV should be working but if it's not, here are just a few more things to try. If you have an extra HDMI cable, try swapping the cable and just use a new one, see what happens. You never know. And another thing to do is maybe the HDMI port that it's plugged into is faulty. So move it from HDMI 2 in the back of the TV as an example to HDMI 1 and see if that works. Alright, that's all the steps you need to follow to fix no signal on your TV. Let's go watch some television! Binge watch Game of Thrones! Yeah! Bingy! The Binge Bot! There's no signal. Not good, not good. I want to watch TV. I don't want to watch this nonsense. I don't want to see this no signal on my screen. Not a fun time. Hmm. Good morning. Ugh. Hey guys, 